lovely people welcome back to this channel yes we are here to talk about hazakes ladies and memelody sandals ladies um, the final of the total energies women's champions league that just ended um some minutes ago yes hazakes ladies have lost 2-0 to um sundowns ladies from south africa and for those of us Ghanaians here in ghana we are so much um, disheartened to hear of this news and to watch the game but you know um for hazakes ladies i want to tell them that look you don't have to be broken hearted you don't have to be down because look you fought a good fight you really fought a good fight and you deserve everything because um a team from hazakes very deprived from western side of ghana and then you go into a tournament like this and you went all the way to the finals competing with a team that has a lot of money that is 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 i don't know how to put it but it's well endowed in terms of money every um sundowns ladies player is going to get or be rich with fourteen thousand dollars as they've won the trophy um today so it tells you about the wealth backing them um this is patrice mosepe's team yes the calf president yes his team the lady side and this is all what he wanted to achieve and he's pumped in a lot of money to achieve this particular feat so for hazakes ladies don't be broken hearted don't be disheartened i'm sure that every Ghanaian watching this particular video agree with me that you've done the yeoman's job you fought very well to put ghana on the map and the final you've done well but i want to put something across to the government to the leaders of the country in 2015 when black stars were second in the afghan african cup of nations the government of the day bought them the players jeep all right the jeep car for each player so i'm sure that it will not be out of place to reward these ladies heavily when they come back to ghana because they've done so 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 well we least expected them to reach the the final of this particular competition and they are in the finals now so i am expecting the government of the day now to reward the players heavily even though they were not able to win the trophy or to win the ultimate but look sandals ladies undoubtedly undoubtedly have been the best in 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 the in the in the competition there is a saying that um attack will win you games but defense will win you trophies and they are the best defensive team in the competition and they that is the reason why they won it look they've not conceded in the competition and it, it, it's not surprising that their goalkeeper had to make that wonderful um, save from the free kick and the goalkeeper is also the best goalkeeper of the tournament so they 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 fought for it and they've gotten it but on the day i think that hazakes ladies have always have a problem with their right um yes their right back because look against a as far of morocco they scored from um um, um a free player on the at the right side of the defense and this particular um, um they also the sound downs ladies had to score from that same angle so it tells us that look we have problems with our right wing back of the hazakes team and that is what i think the coach going forward would have to look very well um so that you fix that particular thing the next thing is that playing as a high line the hazakes ladies have really been struggling and they don't know how to cope with the high line type of defenses and that is the reason why most of the times you see that a counter or a sharp break will obviously unveil the 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 fluorities in their defense and that's the reason why we struggle now it is not surprising we couldn't score against them because i've already said they are the best defensive side in the um, the competition and all of that they've not lost a game in like three seasons last season they played their whole league on beating in south africa so they are very good side so then that's why i think that um hazakes ladies and the whole of ghana shouldn't be worried about this particular um disappointment in the final but rather we should keep hope and then make sure that we fix a lot of things and so that we can we can put um the ghana on the map so much high now 
the next thing for Hazard Kessler, these reasons why they shouldn't be so much down is that look, you are going to get scholarships, you are going to get um, deals from outside and all of that. So that is why you, you've done so well um, reaching the finals of, of the competition and that's why you deserve all the accolades that I'm giving you right now. So thumbs up Hazakes ladies and thumbs up Ghana, thumbs up everybody, the women's team. You've done yourselves proud, you've done Ghana proud and we are so much proud of you Hazakes ladies. We will live to fight another day, Team Hazakes ladies. Do the do.